My name is Thomas Michelle, and I am a third year student at New York Tech, and I'm looking to get my bachelor's in electrical and computer engineering. And this semester I am taking a philosophy of human nature. And uh, this is the first video presentation we were assigned to do on the book Story of Your Life and the movie Arrival. For this assignment, we were uh, selected to choose a topic based on what was listed and make this video explaining uh, our views on that topic and how it ties into the story. The topic that I chose for this assignment was the concept of free will. Now in the story, uh, in the book Story of Your Life, in the story, the character Louise, her job was uh, there were these new beings called the heptopods. They were coming into contact with our world, but they had their own separate language. So Luis had to learn the language, understand it, be able to comprehend it, and be able to communicate with the heptopods so that they could find out their motives of why they're coming in contact with our world and pretty much how they live and act as they choose. With doing that, Louise pretty much rewired her brain, so to say, and she was able to see the future pretty much. She was able to see actions and events that were gonna take on later on. And with doing that, that kinda contradicts when we say we have free will, because if, if she could see the future, that means our actions are already predetermined. Like we're not deciding pretty much at that point what we do and how we live if we could see the future and it's already predetermined. Now, with that being said, my view uh, is with the movie being, you know, classified as a sci-fi film and we've never actually, from what we know, We've never experienced anything like this. I don't know if we could see the future in real life. And so right now, I still believe we have free will, that we still get to pick and choose how we want to live our life. Still believe we have free will, but you know what's out there. Maybe this story and arrival and story of your life could happen to be true and maybe as much free will as we thought we did. Now, when it comes to understanding the concept of free will, at first, the story for the first time was confused <laughs> by the end of the story. I, I didn't really understand like that much after the first time reading it. Like I'm, I'm still a little confused now but I definitely have a better grasp on what the story meant and everything afterwards especially after listening to the video essays and watching the movie after reading the story and the research really helped me uh get a better understanding on it I thought of the movie in the book I thought it was a great story and the I loved growing up watching sci-fi movies so this movie was definitely uh in my realm of what i enjoy watching and overall i thought it was a a great story and a theme to the story on what it meant and how we could tie it into our uh, own lives and how we could use the topics and components of that movie to uh view it in our own perspective so